Hey there, Bikeaholics. Ryan Erlacher here, LawAbidingBiker.com. I just want to thank Oscar for donating this. Yes, it's not a gas cap, but it's a badass bottle opener. And Oscar donated that here to the Law Abiding Biker shop and studio. So, good job. All right, so today I am here to talk to you about the current version of the Rick Rack strapless luggage system. Of course, anything I talk about, links will be in the description below to go right to our store uh, and get those products, guys. We appreciate the support. Um, I just want to educate you a little bit about what's going on here. So, because we got multiple different versions and a few things have changed over time, so this is kind of just an update of where we're at currently. Um, you know. The, the Rick Rack system is great because you don't have to mess around with those stupid bungee cords and strapping stuff down. Um, those can come loose, slap your paint, cause damage, all that kind of stuff. We use these exclusively here at Law Abiding Biker Media, and that's the reason. The other big reason is, is it's so quick. Um, when I get to the hotel or wherever you're staying, to, this simply just uh, attaches uh, to your luggage rack, basically, and we'll get a little more detailed about that. Um, but of course, these go around uh, and then this just clamps down. You've got two clamps and they simply clamp down very quickly like that and unclamp and you're up and running. Uh, so a couple things about this guys, there are different versions of it. And at the end of this video, uh, we will show you an install, but let me get a little bit deeper in that. So you can just purchase the rack and I'll tell you about the different models we have too in a moment, but you can just purchase a rack because it can be used with any bag basically uh, that is bigger than this rack, uh, a, a motorcycle luggage bag to be, uh, bag to be specific. So uh, you can use your own bag and we will show you how to install it. It comes, that'll be at the end of the video, it comes with all the hardware and washers, um, well, uh, it comes with a punch and some other things, everything you need to install it to your current bag. The beautiful part is if you get the entire kit from us, which includes a really nice durable bag. Um, it will come with everything. You'll get the bag, you'll get the rack. Uh, it will be pre-installed. It comes with a lock, uh, the kit. Uh, it comes with a lock so that you can actually lock this rack. It just goes through here, all right? Just goes through there and locks to your luggage rack. It will come with that, that kit basically and a rain cover for the bag too. And it will come pre-ready. The bag will already be mounted to the rack and you're up and running. Uh, so the other way to do it is if you don't want to do that, of course, is get that the bag of your choice and mount it with the hardware. So let's talk about a couple different versions. A couple new things with the line. We've been selling them for uh, a few years now um, and the, the guys are great over at Rick Rack. They are real bikers. They care about bikers just like you guys. We work closely with them. Uh, they kind of have the same mindset uh, as us serving the biker community and we appreciate that about them. And they're always trying to make the product better based on biker feedback. So one of the things they added is these grommets in here now. They didn't used to have that and they do just pop out. Uh, they just have a slit in them and they pop right out. Um, but what those do is that allows you to uh, not bottom this rack out basically. So when you're putting it over your bars on your luggage rack and you're going to clamp it down, you're not gonna hit metal to metal. Um, it also takes up some of the space in here. Uh, when I tighten that, it takes up some of the space in here. So this, you really make sure that the bar on your luggage rack gets right in uh, well, you can see where it's dimpled right there basically so that it makes sure that it's really truly uh, If you see my finger they're grabbing on that bar right where it's supposed to be So that's a nice addition again your rack comes with all this stuff guys. It will come just like this So let's talk a little bit about the different versions So these specifically that you're looking at are for a full touring and what I mean by that uh, You know your trunk on your your uh, Harley full touring. We also have an India model I'll just men mention that too, but your trunk has a lot of space, which is really nice, but you only have that luggage rack on top. And so you're wasting a lot of space or you try to bungee a bag like we talked about up there. It's a real pain in the butt. Um, also, when you strap stuff to the top of that trunk, any of you that have it, you realize how heavy that gets. Well, when you have one of these strapped to it, you've got a whole nother trunk basically on top of the trunk. And when you open it, 
within less than 10 seconds, you can have this off um, so that you can open your trunk and you don't have all that extra weight bearing on it instead of untying things and undoing the bungee cords and stuff like that. The, so this one will work uh, on your full touring on that stock luggage rack basically, okay? And uh, the other one model I have here, and don't worry about this, it, that we're just doing a demo here, but it does come with the rubber grommets in here too. They all come with that now. Um, but this one would be for your air wing. That's that uh, flat and it's a lot uh, sleeker of a rack, that Harley air wing rack. Uh, so make sure when you're ordering from our store, they're in the drop down uh, next to the add to cart button uh, or purchase button. You do have options to get the full package, the bag, and uh, also you wanna make sure that you get the right rack, whether you're running the air wing or the standard Harley rack. But honestly, at the end of the day, uh, just to reveal, he, uh, uh, Shane over there at Rick Rack just makes it so it's ready to go for you. But really they're the same exact rack. Uh, the only difference is uh, for the regular Harley luggage rack, you would just unbolt and move this clamp over. But again, if you order the right one, we'll have it done for you or Shane will over there at Rick Rack. But it's just moved in one hole. Other than that, so if you did get the wrong rack, technically it wouldn't be a big deal. Just pop that over one and now it's ready for the air wing. Or the nice thing is maybe later you will upgrade to an air wing and just understand you don't have to purchase another rack. You're good to go by just moving that clamp over one, guys. So that's kind of our touring full bagger lineup. Um, and uh, we're actually gonna, uh, Oscar's gonna be running this on his. We're gonna install a bag at the end of this video. A couple other things I wanna mention really quick on this is don't forget, we have multiple videos and we've already done some videos in the past on the Rick Rack system. We've got them for road glide and street glide. You're touring, not full touring, a bike without a trunk basically. So the thing about it is um, you're, you're gonna want the full uh, Harley uh, two up King HD flat rack. There's a lot of the aftermarket racks uh, that I don't have one down here I was looking, but they've got the weird bars. You, you really need the flat round bar. Um, that's what it's made for. You can get these from Harley Davidson of course. It's the two up, just look for it. It's the two up rack. That way, this the rack that goes on it, which is a little bit different than this, uh, will actually fit on here properly. Um, uh, so you can head on down the road, not worry about losing it. So use the proper rack. We strongly suggest that. But you can see the rack for the street glide or road glide is just a little bit different. Um, so obviously the other racks I showed you wouldn't work on those racks, so make sure you get the right one. But again, it's the same concept. It's got the hole for the lock. It's got everything you need, um, clamps down, all that kind of stuff. This kit comes with everything you need if you're gonna mount it. I'll just show you some of the hardware. It's pretty basic, but so that your bag doesn't leak. It's got metal washers. It's got rubber washers and rubber grommets and stuff like that. Um, again, we'll go through it at the end of this video. A punch, some anti-seize grease, stuff like that. Um, with that said, guys, I hope that's uh, informative to you and helps you make a decision uh, on what you need. And again, just make sure you select the right one. But we got all the Harley Touring line covered so that you can get up and running. And I'm telling you, once you get one, once you go Rick Rack, you'll never go back. Um, it is so quick when I get to a hotel when we're on seven, 10 day trips and I can just get that bag off quickly, get it back on when I'm up in the morning. Um, don't have a lot of time on those trips when I'm filming and stuff. So um, very nice setup. And don't forget guys, before you leave this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and bell icon. Every time those are hit, another biker joins the revolution and we would love to have you be part of it. With that said, let's go ahead and install this rack. And actually we're gonna install this one because Oscar has a regular uh, uh, tour rack on his trunk and we will put the actual bag we're gonna use is the two up, actually it's the top deck two, excuse me. It's the top deck two bag that uh, you could also get with your rack. All right, and so we're mounting this rack to the top deck two bag. Again, you can get this bag and the whole kit in our store, but if you're mounting it to another bag um, that doesn't come pre-installed, uh, he's just laying the rack down in the right orientation and then he's just got a silver marker and he's just marking all of the holes so we know where we're going to punch them at. So this is a uh, punch that you can actually put in your drill uh, and you can purchase this uh, at the time you purchase your other stuff uh, and it just basically helps you get through the bag and make the holes without twisting up the inner lining and it kind of makes a clean hole so that's what we're going to be using to drill these holes now that they're marked. All right, and he's got his drill lined up and we've already got those holes marked, of course. Uh, 
All right, and just moving on to the other holes here. Pretty standard, just gonna go around and do that to all of them. So in your kit comes all of the washers and hardware you need. He's gonna stage this up first and show you how it goes. So your metal, then your rubber washer, and the screw goes through there, and then we're gonna put that on the inside of the bag and poke it through the bottom. All right, so you can see he has the bag turned over on its side because he's on the inside with his other hand. He's pushing that bolt through that we already have the two washers on there. And then he's gonna put another rubber washer over the side there. And then up with his rack. All right, we also wanna mention before we put any of the nuts on here, just make sure you put uh, anti-seize grease on the actual threads and that will help with corrosion um, as it'll be exposed to moisture and stuff like that, and if you ever needed to take it off. And on with that lock nut. And it'll get, go around and get all these fingers started. There's six of them. And just following up, guys, just to make sure you see there, he has the smaller rubber washer in between the bag and the rack. The big rubber washer goes on the inside of the bag. All right, and so the tools you'll need is a 5 30 seconds hex head and a 7 16 socket. And uh, Oscar will be on the outside here. You can see Lurch is going to the inside of the bag. And they'll just work together to get this hardware on. All right, and that is a one Rick Rack officially installed on this Top Deck 2 bag. All right, and you can see the timer there. We're going to time Oscar and uh, see how quick he can get this Rick Rack bag on his top of his trunk. Timer started. Oscar working feverishly. Look at that. Nice. What are we at, Lurch? Eight seconds. Eight seconds. That's how quick. Let's see how quick you can get it off. And for you bikeaholics that love fishing, check out Nine Toes Fishing on YouTube. All right, and here we go. Five seconds. There you go. And that is how quick you can have it on and off when you get to destination. Yeah.